consumption is a major activity of everyday life. Different economists define consumption in different ways. In simple terms, it is the purchase of produced goods and services by households. Economists are particularly interested in establishing a relationship between consumption and income. Consumption may be studied as the sum of two parts. One part is a proportion of the income and is termed as induced consumption. The other part includes the consumption when income is zero. Such consumption may be made from savings or by borrowing and is not affected even if income is zero. This consumption is termed autonomous consumption. This situation may be expressed mathematically as C is equal to A plus M of Y minus T. C is the total consumption, A is the autonomous consumption and M of Y minus T is the induced consumption. Y minus T is called disposable income. This is the actual income that can be used for consumption after deducting the taxes. M is technically called the marginal propensity to consume or MPC. It represents the change in consumption when income changes. The consumption equation shows that consumption and income share a positive relationship. If disposable income increases, consumption also increases. M is 0.2. It means that 20% of income is used for consumption. Generally, MPC is greater than 0 but less than 1. MPC greater than 1 means that changes in income leads to proportionately larger changes in consumption. The consumption model may also be represented graphically. It gives an upward sloping line and A is the intercept or the starting point of the graph.